Look at 160, you win eight five dollars. That's like two fifty, two hundred fifty dollars in you gaming. What's up everybody? Welcome back to another video. Just to give you guys some background on why I'm making this video, because I have millions of videos about the whole A300. Um, you guys know I'm going back and forth with UPS, with the whole package got damaged, A300 got damaged, and stuff like that. So I fell upon the receipt. I got my earpods on because I'm watching Naruto, by the way. Oh, not Naruto, Baruto. I keep calling him Baruto, Naruto. But yeah, trying to catch up on Baruto. So I sourced out the receipts for the T150 and the A300. So I'm sure you guys are exactly how much I spent on the computer. So as I watched Baruto, I'm going to jump on the computer and show you guys um, where we got the computer, how much everything costs. And the funny thing is, I thought I got the computer from Amazon, but I really didn't. So I'm gonna show you guys once I jump on the computer. All right guys, so here's the receipt for the A300 when I bought it. Of course it was pre-owned, it wasn't a brand new one. I got it here in, 2000, in 2018. So that's how long ago I had this thing. Paid 260 for it. And like I said, these A300s, A200s, 8100, 8000s, whatever, they range in price. So some companies, so if I was you guys and you're trying to do the same setup, do your research first, you know, look on Amazon, look on Best Buy, New Egg, blah, 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 eBay, whatever, because they range. You can get one for 150, but it depends on what's in it. So this one is A300, small, small form factor, and this is really important. Back then when I first started making videos on this computer, like I said, I don't know everything. They come in different uh, sizes. So the small form factor is a smaller one. That's why I need a low profile card because it's a small form factor. They have like the bigger one, they have the business one, they have all different sizes. So if you get the small form factor, you need a low profile card because it's the smaller case. I didn't know that when I was buying it. So I thought all A300s were all the same, but they're not the same. Um, there's even some of them where there are 6300s. So 6300s and the A300s are really similar. The only difference is I think is the chipset and the motherboard. Other than that, they are the same thing. But the A3, these, these are a little more newer than the 6300s or whatever. But a lot of um, places are selling 6300 as A300s because they are the same thing, but they're not the same thing. So hold on, get you guys confused. i5 processor, 3470, quad core, 16 gigs of RAM. So this one came with 16 gigs of RAM already, came with the i5 processor, and it came with two terabyte hard drive. I keep thinking I have a one terabyte hard drive. Well, I had in that one, but it's a two terabyte hard drive. So a lot of memory. So it says Wi-Fi on here. But when you're buying this, you have the option to add in the Wi-Fi card. And I knew I wanted to be plugged in, so I opt out of the Wi-Fi card. So it doesn't come with Wi-Fi on the motherboard. You have to add a Wi-Fi card to it. Since a lot of you guys are new and joining me and don't know what I've been through, where I started from, I want to make this video to kind of give you guys exactly how much I paid and how much it will cost you to start your, your gaming build or your YouTube channel or whatever you want to do. But yeah, so I didn't opt in the Wi-Fi card and it came with Windows 10 already. So the company that did sell me this computer is MyComp, MeComp, I think. That's, I think I'm pronouncing it right. So like I said, I spent 260 for this and you do not, if you want a game, guys, if you want a game, watching this right now, you don't have a computer, you wanna buy your first computer, you end up on my channel seeing me starting my channel stuff with this computer, you do not need to get an Elite A300. I made a video on my sister's computer. She has an 8100. Yeah, she has an 8100 with a 1030. It's cheaper than this. You don't have to spend $260 on this. Only reason why I bought this for $260 is because I wanted the, a higher spec, but not the highest, because the highest is the, the better processor with these computers, and maybe more RAM, and um, it comes standard with SSD storage, instead of that hard HDD, but you don't need to get this. I'm telling you guys right, you don't need to get this. A lot of a lot of people have been hitting me up like, hey, I'm gonna buy the same thing you have. I don't have that much money, but I wanna buy the same setup. Save your money and get the 8100, 8200, get something older. You know, you don't have to get it with 16 gigs in it already. It don't have to have two terabyte. The RAM, I recommend 16 gigs, but for the for the memory, um, 500 gigabytes on a regular HD is fine. You know, your computer's gonna be slow. Booting things up is gonna be slow. You can buy an SSD for hundred some dollars like I did. That's all up to you. All you really need to game. This is the secret. This is the secret recipe right here. Here's the secret formula. You need this computer, a graphics card, and that's it. That's it. You don't need nothing else. Go on my playlist and go back in time. Go look at my first videos on the A300 and look where I started from. 
I bought the computer. I had no graphics card. I tried playing, I think, American Truck Simulator without the graphics card. I don't remember. But yeah, the computer, graphics card, you're Gucci, you're Golding, you can game. You're not going to be playing on no Ultra or nothing like that, but at least you're PC gaming. I had to stop for a second and get some water because I'm babbling right now. And I had to run get some water. All right, guys, let's continue on. I did have to focus on that part because I get a lot of questions, and this that's okay. Ask me as much questions as you can. There's nothing wrong with asking questions. You can, you're can you not going to learn if you don't ask questions, so I get it. It's all you need, and you don't have to get a 1050 either. You don't have to get a 1030. You can get the 750. Um, there's like so those $100 graphics cards, because a lot of people write me every day. Like I said, I get messages every day. I love it. I love. I try to help as much as I can. I try to respond as fast as I can. I'm only one human and I got things going on in my life too, you know, so I try to get back to you guys when I can. For those of you that want to buy this computer and not buy a graphics card and ask me how well does it play, look, listen, love you guys, but if you buy this computer and don't put a graphics card in it and try to play something, you're going to get negative 5,000 um, frames per second. Like, you're going to try to go in a video game and you're gonna lag. It's gonna look like you're playing on a Game Boy Color, trying to play Fortnite on a Game Boy Color. It's, you need the graphics card because this is not a gaming PC. Uh, I know it's you know the prices on them could be pretty low, especially if you have a nice used one, but they're not gaming PCs. They're just higher and desktop computers back then, which were pretty good. That's why when you put a graphics card in them now, they, they can play decent. They can play decently. They can play newer games. But you need a graphics card. You really want to budget it out. Get an 8100. Get a 1030 like Jay did. Save you some money. All right, let's go to the graphics cards. All right, so I did get the graphics card on Amazon because I made this big mistake and I said in the vlog, I bought a 1050 Ti for my 8300 when I first got it. And you can see, look, this is I ordered in 2018. This is all back in 2018. I bought a 1050 Ti. It was not the low profile. It was a regular 1050 Ti. I got so excited, I tried putting it in the case, it didn't fit because I have a small form factor. So let's go back. Small form factor right here. So if, you get, if you're going to get the small form factor like I have, you have to get a low profile, low profile graphics card. It don't have to be the Gigabyte. So I have Gigabyte GeForce. It don't have to be Gigabyte. It could be just like other brands that make 1050s uh, low profiles, but it needs to be a low profile. The low profile is smaller than the regular 1050. I bought mine from Best Buy, and I bought it right off the shelf. I was so excited, and it couldn't fit. And then I had to bring it back, return it, and then I ordered this. Because I didn't realize that you have to get I didn't know the difference. I didn't know that there's a low profile, and there's a I thought 1050 is a 1050. And I've seen other people do it, where they put 1050 in their 8300. So I'm like, okay, whatever. A lot of you guys may make this mistake, too, with me. Some people hit me up and let me know they have. So, and for the future guys, you know, make sure it's low profile. I'm going to continue to repeat myself in this video, saying the same thing over and over. That way, I'm just getting it out to you guys. Because I don't want you guys to make the mistake I made. I want to save you time. I want to save you money. You're watching this video because you either want to see how I, you know, what I went through. Or you want your own gaming PC for, you know, your stuff. So, my video where I put the, um, where I put my Gambius build together. A lot of the professionals or people that know more about me say, hey, I recommend this, I recommend that, I recommend this, I recommend that. Uh, uh, uh. Because there's a lot of stuff I missed out because I don't know, you know. This is why I love my channel because I can go back in time and watch all these videos. Once I learn more about computers and stuff like that. And like, oh yeah, dummy, you should have knew that. But at least you guys can see my growth and where I came from and my knowledge. And it will always just be there. But... Yeah, this is what I got. Gigabyte GeForce G GTX 1050 Ti, low profile. Now there is a 1050, not the Ti. Ti is like a better 1050. You can get a 1650 as well, which is better than a 1050. When I was getting this graphics card, I didn't even know about a 1650. I knew about the 1030, 1050, and 1050 Ti. Those are three cards I was looking at. I'm like, okay, I'm building this computer. I'm the type of person where if I'm specking something out, I never get the, 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 the base bare metal. Sometimes it don't make sense to spend to get the highest top of the line version of something because it just don't make sense. You're doing too much. But sometimes it's not good to get the lowest either because I knew I wasn't going to have this computer for long and I knew that I was going to build another computer from scratch when I first bought this computer. The only reason why I started with the A300 and not... Oh, the microphone's mad far away. You guys, I hope my audio wasn't too low just now because I had the microphone with nowhere near me. So, when I'm going back and editing, 
if my vo- the volume changes because I was far away from the mic this whole time. So, so my bad about that. But what I was saying before I realized I don't have a mic, the reason why I didn't just build my PC, build a, like a PC from scratch and the skip start from this is because I was getting to this for the first time and I just wanted an idea of PCs. You know, I wanted to get into gaming PC, but I kind of wanted to slowly ease my way in there. This was real easy. It was 250 Let's go back. So, was this 260 for the computer itself? And this is July 20th and in August. So, the next month I ordered a graphics card. So, I was able to spend 260, go back to work, 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 save up, spend another almost $200. So, in total, if my calculation is correct, was that 260, 29? I'm sweating. You guys got me doing math and stuff. It's like 440. Oh, yeah, this is even. So, yeah, so four, 449.21 total, yeah. So, these two both together, 449.21 in total is what I spent on this computer. Now, is that the cheapest? No, it, no, it's not. Like I said, you can get a way more budget computer. You can save way more money. So, if I'm almost spending $500 on this. And then, like I said, this thing had 2 terabytes, 16 gigs. It's an A300. I got a 1050 Ti. So I can say this setup is not the high end, which you can do with this, but it's not basic at all. Like I was able to play Fortnite. I played Forza. Forza is a big game. So the fact that I was actually playing Forza was actually a big deal. I was playing Forza, I played any game I threw at it. There hasn't been a game that I haven't played that I couldn't play. I was able to play Fortnite on high so that the Fortnite videos I made on this channel, they all were playing on high. If you play it over on medium or low, you're fine. It won't lag, no nothing. So everyone has been asking me why does it lag on my Fortnite videos because I was playing on high. I don't know why I even did that. I should have did it on medium so you guys could see it. But then again, I want to be more realistic to show you guys its potential. So if you play on high, you may lag here and there. But it mostly lag when you're dropping in, not when you're just on the ground. Almost $500 is what I spent exactly on the A300 and the 1050 Ti. Now, I have a lot of people cursing me out saying, you know, this is not a budget build because you have a almost a $200 keyboard, you almost have a $100 mouse, you have um, $500 worth of monitors. Guys, the reason why I went with Corsair and Asus and all these good brands for the setup when I got the A300 is because I knew I was gonna build a computer. Cause now look, now that I'm not using the A300, my Gambia's build, I already have a keyboard already, I already have a mouse already, my monitor's ready, you know, like speakers ready, like all the stuff I bought with the A300, I knew I was gonna reuse them for my next computer build. So that's the whole point of why I got that. The um, when we let's go back to the A300, the the mic, the mic, was it the Mi Comp, Mi Comp, whatever. This thing came with a keyboard and it came with a mouse. It came with like a like a cheap keyboard, cheap mouse. You can game on that, you know, if you on a budget. Like you you don't have to get all the stuff I got. But like I said, I'm the type of person where I don't get the base basic, the bare minimum of nothing. But I don't get too high either. That's why with the Gambia's build, I got a you know decent. It's actually a nice um, motherboard with a older processor. I could have got a newer processor. Everyone was like, "Why would you get that processor with that motherboard?" Computers are upgradable. So if you get a cheaper part now, like let's say you build a computer and one of your parts are cheaper, you can upgrade it later. You know, like like the whole point of this build was one to build my first computer from scratch. Two. Get an idea of what it's like to build your first computer from scratch. And three, I knew it wasn't going to be perfect. It's my first computer that I built. Like, I don't think people in that uh, video was understanding that that's the first computer I've ever built. Like, all the professionals was expecting it to be perfect, and I have no idea why. Like, you don't you don't drive for the first time, and you're an expert driver. You could be on um, Baby Driver 2 movie or something like that. Like, it, you know, it, it takes practice. You know, you gotta start from somewhere. And you get, anyways, that's this is the breakdown of everything. Now, if you want to see what I got, what I spent on SSD, um, like I said, my keyboard, my mouse, all that stuff, it's on the playlist of the A300. But that stuff don't matter. What's really, you guys didn't click this video to see what mouse I'm using, what keyboard I'm using, what microphone I'm using. You guys want it to, you want a game. You want a computer and start gaming. All right, so we're on Amazon. Let's, let's, let's do a little shopping. Let's do a little shopping. So, um, HP 8100. Let's look this up real fast. Oh, God. No, no. Do I have to put Elite? I just got to put Elite. Okay, here we go. So, for example, 
Look at this thing. This thing is seven. Yo, people are. I'm telling you guys, people are buying these things. So whoever refurbished this, they put a um one terabyte. Is this SSD? Oh, that's SSD. Eight gigs of RAM, three point two gigahertz processor speed, i5, one sixty. And this is yeah, the renewed oh, one terabyte hard drive. Okay, so no SSDs in this. This is 160 guys, $160. And then that's $160. And then let's do a um, what, 1030. All right, so that's $160, right? And this is a 1030. I put I typed in 1030 low profile graphics card. This is $85. Look at that, 160, you went $85. That's like $250, $250, and you gaming. You slap that in the graphics, you gaming. Like, like that's $250. I spent almost $500 on my setup because of what I wanted. But I just showed you guys $250. Easy. That's it. You know, like, and here's the thing. Like, people are showing me, let me let me look this up. A lot of people are like, hey, can I use a 750? And I'm like, how much is a 750? Bruh. See, look, I, put, I typed in 750. Okay, look, they got 710. This is $50. You have a 730, $76. You might as well get a 1030. The 1030 is like ten dollars more. Like, yeah, nah, son, nah, son. You see this little, you see this little slot. How it look like this? This I know for sure. Fit. This is this is what I have. This is one sixty one. Oh look, this thing's on sale. Look, so the graphics card I bought is actually on sale. So look at this. This thing is on sale, brand new right now. But yeah, two fifty. You don't even have to get what I get, son. Let me see what A300s are going for right now. So they look, they're not even that. See, look, this is an ultra slim. For, look at this, ultra slim. I told you how they come in different sizes. So you have the small form factor. This is what I got. One, look at that, 160. This one, I5. See, look, 8 gigs of RAM, 500 gigabytes. So you pay for what it, what it is. And a lot of people are asking me, do you have to have an SSD? What the SSD is going to do is going to, if you click it, if you click the game, it boosts it up like that. If you turn on your computer and Windows is on your SSD, Windows will start like that. When you have the HDD, I think in some of my previous videos, I, I showed some speed tests or what's going on. The HDD, it takes a long for it to load and it starts screaming and bad noise. It makes a lot of noise. SSD is like that. I use the M.2 to boot up on my Gamdius build right now. And psh, boy, whenever, when I went back to New York and I was turning on my sister's um, 8100, I thought I broke it because it took forever to, to boot up. It was the fans were spinning and it was loud. I was like, what the hell? But that's how it is. I forgot how uh, a normal hard drive is. But look at this 16 gigs. So this is 16 gigs of RAM. This comes with a 240 gigabyte SSD. They got HDMI, Bluetooth, Wi-Fi for 185. That's not bad. You got to upgrade that memory though because you're going to fill up 512 gigs like nothing but this this is not bad i paid 260 for my oh but that's the ultra small form factor see i don't even know if you guys would even need this because i don't know the graphics card is going to fit in that so look at this one you see how big this is this is now a small form factor this is the bigger version to mine and you can probably fit a regular 1050 in this don't don't take me don't take my word for it though i have no idea but look how big this thing is I don't see why a 1050 wouldn't be able to fit on this thing. But yeah, look, they come in different sizes. You know, they come in different keyboards. And this is just Amazon. They have it where you go on eBay, you go on Newegg, you can go on any refurbished computer site that sells computers and get you guys something like this. And I know I'm probably leaving out a lot of stuff. My videos are not scripted, you know, and there's no wrong with being scripted, but I like the raw, natural. That's why when I was building the computer for the first time, I didn't put on a tripod not because I like that I like that raw you know just raw video see it from my eyelids you know like it's not like some professional there's nothing wrong with having professional footage and putting things together and stuff it's just that you know I, I like how I like at the end of the day when you have a YouTube channel it's your YouTube channel you should do what you want to do you know it's gonna be a lot of opinions out there but it is what it is but um I hope I answered some questions for you guys so we're gonna switch back to the we're gonna switch back to the vlog camera but I hope I my, by me doing this, I, I answered a lot of questions for you guys. I feel like I gave a lot of information. I've been talking for like 20 some minutes, but after edit, it's, it's gonna be shorter, but whatever. I felt like this video needed to be made, not only because I made so many videos on this computer. I learn a lot every day, and by me putting videos on YouTube, I feel like I, if I need to update you guys, I'm gonna update you guys. A lot of you guys out there are way younger than me. You know, you probably still live with your parents, and you know, probably in high school, or elementary school, and you're trying to get the gaming computer. But one thing you guys need to realize is that 
I didn't get my first, this whole computing, I didn't do it till I was 23 or something like that. A lot of you guys are 16, 17 saying, you know, I really want a, a gaming PC, you know, I wish I want to start my YouTube, I want a game. And I appreciate you guys, you know, you guys are young, want to start early and stuff like that, but you gotta remember, things take time too. The fact that I was able to do this and I live on my own, like I said, when you guys get older and you get your first apartment or you live on your own, you, you, you know what I'm talking about. I don't live with my parents, you know, my parents don't give me money, you know, me and Michelle, we work, we do our thing, but I work hard for everything I have. So when I started all this stuff, you know, no one, I didn't win a giveaway, no one gave me free anything. I had an idea, I always wanted a YouTube channel, I always wanted to game on the PC, so I just made it happen. And that's a message I just wanted to give to some of you guys too, because on my last vlog about I'm doing a new giveaway, everyone's kind of explaining why they should win the computer because you know, their family is poor or they always want to make a channel or I, I appreciate you guys dropping down what you're going through. And I definitely read all of those. I hear you guys out, you know, but I haven't even decided if I'm going to give away a computer or a part or what yet. So I don't know if everyone is assuming that I'm going to give away a computer. I have, I have no idea why. And I'm not going to pick someone through the comments either. You know, I, this is a... Uh, if you guys entered the last giveaway I did, it's random. You fill out a form that gives you a chance to be in there and you're gonna be put on a spin wheel. I spin the wheel and whoever it lands on, I call, you're the winner. That's pretty much how I'm gonna do it this time as well. So all the new people that don't know what I did before, that's how it's gonna be. I'm not just gonna pick someone out of the comments, you know. But I do appreciate you guys leaving your story down. You know, like some of you guys saying, you know, your family's real poor, you guys can afford a computer. And you know, I, I, and I get it because you know when I grew up, I grew up in a basement in New York. My family did not have a lot of money either. We didn't have no computers or none of that stuff. You know, I mean, but my generation is different. You know, when we were younger, we were outside running around, playing tag and manhunt and stuff. The world now is very technical. There's a lot of technology in place. You know, kids are like five years old with iPads. You know, like when I was five years old. I had no type of electronic, you know, like, but times are just different now. So I get it. It's a different time than having a computer or having like a cell phone or having a, a video game or some type of a tablet or whatever. It's normal now, especially when you're like eight, 10 years old. It's interesting how the norm is different between generations. Cause when my parents was younger, what I went through and had, they definitely didn't have, you know? So it, it's just interesting. I'm not saying you guys shouldn't share your story or anything like that. I just want to let you guys know that I haven't decided on the giveaway, what's going to be the giveaway, and you know it's going to be at 5,000 subscribers. We're about to hit 4,000, we're close to 4,000, so that gives me some time to kind of figure out what needed to be done. I'm going to decide on what I'm giving away way before 5,000 subscribers, so probably when I reach like mid four, I should have an idea. And then once 5,000 hit, boom, giveaway is going to get started and we go from there. I've been babbling for like a good 50 years now. I'm going to make something like this in the future just... So everybody's on the same page. A lot of people have been telling me that I should make more car stuff. I have a lot of car stuff coming. Don't worry about that. And I have a lot of stuff coming for the computer. I mean, for the for the whole this whole game room. So don't worry about that. Because the setup I have right now is not what I vision. Like what I visioned, you guys are gonna see it happen in the future. It's gonna it's gonna be it's gonna be a one. It's gonna be top notch. Like what I have right now is just for right now. You know, just just gonna work for right now. But what I have vision, this whole room is gonna be. Just watch. Just watch and see. You guys are gonna just watch and see. Just watch. That's all I gotta say. Just watch and see. Thank you guys for watching. Write me on Discord. Write me on Instagram. Drop a comment. Any questions? I'll try to answer, and I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Okay.